Hello and welcome to another episode of The Playlist, your favorite entertainment show sponsored by EJ Investments. My guest today is a Gambian artist, born and raised in the ghetto youths all the way from Brikama. He's representing everyone in Gambia, especially the voiceless. Stay with us and enjoy Chronic Bar all the way from Brikama to represent the Gambian industry. Stay with me and enjoy The Playlist. Satini. I like you, I like you. 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 Voice of Kuke, Alan Kokoi Tarolo, Amanke Fell Fenya in life, Akamala Boy, Sano Long, Goy Momoya in life, Anala on Problemo Long, Lanuro Satine Kudok, Amanke Go Isao Long, Ikoi Jawolo, Where are three Fongal Long? You say Hakilo DK Kult, you can't have song Isao Loyla. Welcome to the playlist. It's a pleasure, TZ, you know, Sally TZ, it's a pleasure. Afoba. Afoba. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> so let's cheers to the ginger. I feel anything, man. First of all, do you drink ginger? Oh well, it's not my favorite, but I do take Can it I sometimes. Can I see you have a sip? You wanna see me have a sip? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because it's not your favorite. Mm. So I'm trying to see you have I, a sip. Well, this one is special, man. This one mm. is special, yeah. Yeah, that's it's, uh, different. It's the playlist um, ginger. Okay, this. It's very good for the body, <laughs> especially. A majority of guys. Okay. I don't know how much other they have Sierra me okay. But majority of guys like to drink ginger. I can remember there was this time I was closing from work and I have a bottle of ginger. I met someone, he's a friend, and the person mm -hmm. was like, Don't must ginger. I'm like, why? And the person said, Because I'm gonna make a good use out of it. I'm like, What yeah. use could that be? But he never explained any further, so yeah. But anyways, welcome to the playlist. It's a pleasure once again. So before we go any further, can you mm -hmm. tell the viewers out there who Chronic Bob is? Okay. Yes, Chronic Bob, um, my bot name is Buba Bojang. Mm -hmm. eh, Bubakar Bojang. Mm -hmm. Yeah, stage name commonly known as Chronic Bob. Mm -hmm. Chronic Bob. Yeah, Chronic Bob is a youth, mm -hmm. you know, born in the Gambia here. Mm -hmm. So out here doing music representing the struggle you know because as you know i'm here for the voiceless and for the people who don't have the opportunity to speak up their mind you know okay so that's chronic bob out here representing the ghetto youths you know so which ghetto youth though all the ghetto youths across the world you know okay but yeah, especially where especially if the people from the slum you know the people okay. on the low low you know cause, oh wow yeah, the low low yeah Hey, the low low. Low, low. So the low low people, you got a representative. I'm yeah. part of the low low, so I'm glad that you are <laughs> representing us real good, yeah? That's so it, what man. drew you into the music scene? Yeah, Chronic Bob, I've been inspired by a whole lot because, you know, I can say actually, yeah, music, I, start, I started listening to music from my dad, you know. My dad, he vibes with, I can say, all types of music. I oh, was listening your dad to, is an artist? He's not an artist, but... He listens to music a lot. Since I was a kid, I think he has almost all genres of music, you know. Okay. He plays when his friends are around, so I've been listening to music for a long, long time. But do you have a specific artist that you were listening yeah, to? Yeah, yeah. And... Then, then later on, mm -hmm. yeah, as I was living in Brikama, mm -hmm. yeah, from the block I came from, mm -hmm. um, Newtown, mm -hmm. this is the community, this is the area where Benjamin, P. Mac, and mm -hmm. S.T. and all others, mm -hmm. like, basically started their career from, you mm -hmm. know. So I was raised in this area in Brikama. So I was inspired by these people, same time by the people I was listening to. Okay. Yeah, so. So SO to Benjamin, to um, ST, ST Brikama P Boyo, Mac, P Mac, because y'all <laughs> really inspired Chronic Bob to get into the music scene, which is a very great thing. So Chronic, yeah. how many music have you produced since you started well for the record right now um i have a couple of singles mm -hmm. i think i had about five singles five singles. Yeah, five singles and i had like 
um, I released an EP mm -hmm. in early 2018 last year, which was Kijafaro. I think it was a four track EP. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's called Kijafaro. Kijafaro, yeah. What is Kijafaro? You know, Kijafaro, it's like Kijafaro means like it's like nightmare or frightening, you know. Okay, being scared, you know. Are you scared of anything? No, the content of the song Kijafaro, it relates it to the, I mean, the the negative side and the disadvantages of social media, mm -hmm. how it is, the influence of it on our people. It's really frightening, yeah, social so media, that, especially that, that, in our generation. Yeah, so that was one of the things that inspired me into building up that song, Kija mm -hmm. and then create a whole project, mm -hmm. uh, an EP, a short EP, mm -hmm. um, titled it Kija Faro. So I can you can you um, sing to us one song yeah. in the Kija Faro EP? Yeah, yeah. Okay, let me go with this one, you know. Mm -hmm. Okay, it goes like Ngai bol ba janjan ding al hawa kona ko iPhone ol ni Samsung olu alaman tangkala ni smartphone ol la masi bol la hey tizi ngala al hakilo tu al la natalo ulto ni natalo dol wala ka kela ka saro ti kija faro ah kija faro hey ah ah I go will live in a city. For a cook, I alone go quite taro long. A man can't find find you in life. A camera boy, son alone. I'm going more more in life. I'm not on problem alone. Lanjuro satin ne kudoke. A man can go isa alone. I go ija alone. Where are they found alone? I see how kilo tiki kuolto. I can't song isa way loila. Ya innocent jamal le put jan tele bla baya kau le lela. Ya hadomi jambur tahud fi sa hal be seda. Nigga stone in snakes. Legi can say food sim beda. Mota nyingi wari preaching to this a cappella. Nkonga ajele molka falim 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 kowena. Womati na ever snitch on the brother from another mother loyalty. Nganyo mutaye bambang. Nyokano badi ya follow for si janjang. Hasidi ya si fatamfansu we katajana. Nkole kukili na kanta mira. Niggas talking like they work for Al Jazeera. Suturo banda personal problem will be tata social media. The mal can you sell out all this hatred getting bigger? A fobang, Jamfa Felesiari, Dolin Kotol Bakuyari, Jamani Labau Kaku Siatam Kodindin will be but Tinari, Kuma Balba Tila, Mobe Daba Diari, Kendo Sato Mandia, Tisi, Plastico Felesiari. I'm telling you, Bukela Mokendol and Fotumalam in Nabo Koliari, Bajella Nyofe, Nyol Bakuari, Nanil Mantara Seniari, and Kata Wokla Muk, Fonga Nyomutanga Nyo Sambaku, cause Ninka the killing the Hanimo killing at a Batala Su. Very, very impressive. Yeah, uh, <laughs> yes, I cannot really say it, but I'm understanding everything he's saying. And you know, this is very important, um, Bob, because um, right now they're not united. Understand that people are just backstabbing people. There's a lot of pollution, Trust you know, all these things. And I'm glad mm -hmm. um, I'm not voice your hamne. They're really representing all these problems because people need to know what is really existing, especially in communities. Your hamne, um, less privileged people, you I'm really gra uh, glad that you did a piece yeah, like this. Yeah, man, you're yeah, really man. doing a great job. Mm -hmm. And if you continue doing this, you are going to excel in whatever you're doing. Inshallah. Congratulations. I like yeah. this. So I'm glad you're doing something like this. Afoba. So what else um, in your EP are you working on? Lohamne, it's going to be of um, interest to the people that are out there. Yeah, man. As of now, you know, I was, I'm done with those singles. I'm done with the EP project. Mm -hmm. So I am currently working on another project mm -hmm. that I've not, like, completed it yet but it's okay. coming up it's called Lubuti Keso Lubuti Keso Lubuti Keso Lubuti Keso so what's that yo that is like yo Lubuti Keso means like I mean if like a party or whatever occasion it is going fine but at its climax mm -hmm. if it's above what it has to be you know come you need chill chill be so hard over over chill okay so look up like we're gonna stuff 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 understand i'm trying okay. to frame it up okay yeah so lubidi keso is a project that i'm coming up and it has it's gonna be a tough one what is it centered on um it's music mm -hmm. yeah a um, couple of tracks yeah i mean the context yeah the context it's um, what are you talking about this time talking about a lot mm -hmm. uh from my own side mm -hmm. to the people i'm representing mm -hmm. To the bigger hits, mm -hmm. you know, 
still on the tr on the struggle because mm -hmm. that is what my music is all about you know right. i speak for my people okay. the less privilege as i said mm -hmm. yeah and still i have a project in it that is regarding mm -hmm. the current situation mm -hmm. that is not only affecting the gambia but i mean globally okay our problems you know so this is a huge project mm -hmm. that one has to look forward to mm -hmm. listening to great yeah so like you said social media can make you or break you yeah. it's a platform where if you um, use it wisely it's going to sell you yeah. if you don't use it wisely I'm afraid it will have to ruin your life mm -hmm. because we've seen a lot of people in Yohamne they've made a huge growth um, using social media yeah. but also there are a lot of people in Yohamne it has I mean put them into depression you know isolation and a trust lot of it. things trust it. so what and how do you intend to use social media as an artist well, me as an artist, you know, social media, I use it in a positive way. Mm -hmm. yeah, positive ways like trying to sell my brand, mm -hmm. take my music out there, mm -hmm. reach the audience, mm -hmm. the people that are following me up, and mm -hmm. then also sensitize on the good sides of it, you know, because it's not a platform that we should use to mm -hmm. create violence or hatred yes. amongst ourselves, mm -hmm. as we see. Such things inspired me into building up that project that we just lament on, you know. Yeah. I mean, Kijafaru, yeah. because we all know that mm -hmm. we've all, we all in the same community, we've seen mm -hmm. what social media has done mm -hmm. to our friends, mm -hmm. you know, our families, our loved ones, you know, mm -hmm. our lovers, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, we are trying to, what I'm trying to do here is use the positive side of it mm -hmm. with a positive influence on the people okay but not something negative that will affect not only the children you know mm -hmm. not only the elders but mm -hmm. it's gonna affect everybody but well, what do you have to say to the people that are out there as an artist that use the platform for instance problems social media social media or conflict based on marriage or whatever you do social media you have to what do you have to say to these um, people that are practicing leaning all the time like it's it's like a karma sometimes yo like do unto others as you would like others to do unto you mm. this is something that everyone should believe in mm. because <clears throat> we should not try to hurt each other badly uh, to the extent that you try to like um, deform deformation of character, mm -hmm. spoiling people's character just because of your own interest. I think we should bring unification, mm -hmm. unity, not by mouth, but in a reality, you know, by, by action. action. In the heart. We come together. We, if we learn how to forgive each other, mm -hmm. if we learn how to love each other, mm -hmm. I think there will be no problem in our society. Of course. So first, the love starts with ourselves. We love it ourselves. Mm -hmm. Love the people around us. Mm -hmm. Show them real love. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we understand each other. We learn to forgive each other. Then all these problems that are happening, swear to God, it will really go down or they won't be happening. Anymore. No so more. So use social media. Um, positively send positive message out there because um, social media right now is a platform where even babies are don't using know who's it. watching yeah so don't just go in there and do whatever you want to do just because you want to please yourself or just say anything you want to say which is not going to be healthy for anyone out there to listen to talk less of young people so I'm glad that you really did that great piece on Kijafaro so um, <laughs> have you ever collaborated with any Gambian artist yeah, man, I've did, I've collabos, I've did a couple of collabos, you know. Yeah, I've did a couple of collabos uh, with uh, with big names in the game, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, recently I um, had a couple of ones with, um, I was featured in ST's album Saluto. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we did a joint together. We did you perform at the Saluto yeah, concert? Yeah, 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 yeah. Performed right. at the Independent Stadium. Uh, mm -hmm. We did a track together, me, mm -hmm. uh, Lil Ums, mm -hmm. Attack, yeah. Kombonka and ST, you know. Yeah, and it was fire. Wow. I had a couple of collabs with my man over there mm -hmm. in the US, J Mills. Mm -hmm. You know, J Mills Studio, yeah, J Mills, I know Mills. Yeah, Soundbag. Yeah, SOT yeah. J Mills. And Lil Arms again, which was the hard times. Mm -hmm. We did that. Um, yeah, I did. I did like a lineup at Stylish Studio mm -hmm. <coughs> with few Gambian artists. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and had one with P Mark also on my mind Dels, you know Dels. Yeah, I know Dels. He yeah. he's been he's been behind me a very long time. So shouts to Dels, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so to Dels. So are you um in any record level or 
Yeah, for the moment, like, um, I'm working with my team, um, Style of House, mm -hmm. Mafia Black Entertainment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I got this connection with Bricks Boy Boya. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's in Brigama and with his studio, Conscious Vibes. But I am not officially signed to any record label or working with it. Chronic Bob is just Chronic Bob with his movement. You know? Okay. Yeah. So you have been nominated for the Wasahara Award in the category of New yes. Artist of the Year in 2018. Yes. How does that make you feel? Boom! This tells them to get ready. Kaino, Honey Ebal, Lubidi Kesso. I was elected. I was nominated, sorry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, and shouts to the winners. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that shows you that, yeah, man, they are upon the grind. So appreciated all those who have voted and nominated for me. Mm -hmm. Yes, and it inspires me that, yo, man, you have no time, man. You got to do a whole lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, so it's a big inspiration. Just for the rappers and everybody out there to know that this mm -hmm. is just the beginning. Mm -hmm. I'm coming up. Being elected for the new artist of the year means, yo, mm -hmm. Chronicle is out for everything. Yeah, man. and he's getting familiar to by what he's doing. So watch out for that. Style union. Right. <laughs> so do you look up to any artists here in the Gambia? Yeah, I, I, yeah, I have artists in the Gambia who I listen to. Who no, I no, look up to. Uh, who I look up to. Yeah. I look up to artists. As your yeah. competitors, though. As my competitors. Yeah. Yeah, competition is part of the game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Who do you think is competing you? Like, oh, I need to be very careful of this person. <laughs> or I need to be very careful of that. I person. think all the artists out there mm -hmm. are competing me. Really? Yeah. Every wow, artist out works. there. Every artist out there. They know the boy, man. Man, still a fire. Stylo check. Honey, bang. Fambe Fambul, Kuta Jambul, Saddam, Nina Kuta Nyobul, Lumatek, Dafaset, Faransi, Angale, Bonzu, 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 Jamare, Kanka, the Sniggers, the Rap, Teddy, Tapale, Promo, Tay, Bari, Kenny, Japale, Nemi, Rabela, Boika, Kamfale, Neil, Will, Fali, Safoko, Ye, Jamfale, Hey, Okulin, all the artists, man, at Hey, that's dope, that's dope, I like that. I like that. The more that you want to know, the flow, you know. Maybe you remix style of Yeah. You check out coffee. We should, we should. Yeah. I'm really interested. <laughs> so have you performed in any big concerts before? Yeah. I've been to the Afro Diaspora Festival with Loot and Fire, Fantan Mojang, you know, by DJ T Fire and a whole lot of big artists in the Gambia here. I've been at the stadium for ST, ST Saluto album launching. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been to Nobles um, last year launching at Pencham mm -hmm. Hall mm -hmm. at the Brikama Kambem Festival. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've never been officially to the Open Mic or so, but I've uh, years ago, like I've been invited to pass through on freestyle sections, you know. Okay. Yeah, but last year I was not there at all. So. But do you look forward to be there? Man working, so I know open mic soon coming. Okay. Yeah, man. And when open mic comes, they will give mm. you a ring. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring. <laughs> and he bang. First I check. <laughs> yes, first I check. So how's your relationship with um, the Gambian artists? Yeah, I'm cool Especially with... Especially the upcoming ones. <laughs> I'm cool with most of, most of these artists, you know, one love. Mm. Yeah, you know, it, that's the nature of music and the competition. Sometimes, you know, people get a little bit bossy, you know what yeah. it is. I mean, style winning hunger. <laughs> Self esteem. <me. laughs> so, but yeah, it's one love. Shouts to all upcoming artists in the Gambia. Same yeah. way, all out there on the grind. Mm. Just tell you, you know, yeah, man. Man is good with everyone. Yeah, I'm good with everyone. I don't know, man. Yeah, but if anyone is not good with you, yeah, man, come on. Try to be good, or yeah. Right. Oh, yeah. So, do you have any diss songs or anything? Like Ego Trip? Oh. Um, I have a couple of, uh, have a couple of songs that are really hard, and sometimes you know artists. I think it's necessary. Yeah, sometimes they you feel know, themselves. One in it. Yeah, like, hang on, my explain. Yo, you yeah, got so to chill. Couple of shots. Hang on, you might explain. Mm. Uh -huh. Pull it up. Boom. <laughs>
All right, let's go for a short commercial. We'll yeah be right man, back. Yeah, man, yeah, man. Dreaming of owning a property in a prime location with great proximity and fantastic neighborhood? EJ Investments Sanyang Seaview Estate is the best choice you have been waiting for. Our Sanyang Seaview Estate is approximately 15 minutes drive away from the busy hop of Brusubi roundabout and into the heart of nature where you can have a peaceful and relaxed lifestyle with your family. You can buy a finished four bedroom story with five year flexibility flexible payment plan or a service plot with two-year payment plan option. With over 300 homes, you will enjoy big tar roads with covered drainage, modern electrification with solar street lights, gated entrance with security post, and a breath-catching experience of our beautiful sea view and lake view. You can own a home today at our Sanyang Sea View Estate. Call us today on 446-4838 or 325-9220. Visit our website on ejinvestments.com. Net. EJ Investments, first in property. Welcome back to the playlist, your favorite entertainment show, hosted by your favorite host, Sally TZ. And Chronic Bob is uh, killing it right now. Uh, well, Chronic, tell me what you want to do with them halfway. They're not going to have them any. Boy, TZ, boy, this guy, man, I'm not that much into ginger. Why, yeah. boy? Like, you just now, Luther. So you need guy in your way finger and they just ginger because. Papa, let me guide you to ginger because I'm many. But especially you now, and yo, know, it gets a lot of fire and energy in it, man. Fire plus fire. Kerry Fado, thanks for this one, man. A <laughs> favor. One more time. Hey. I'll check. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Mm. So ginger bangla over fire. So let's get some fire questions right now. Acha, acha. Yep. So um, how do you see yourself, or where do you see yourself in the music industry? in two years time yeah man two years time inshallah mm -hmm. i'll be on the top of my grind you know mm -hmm. i know music is never easy takes a lot of time you know the grind is never easy but mm -hmm. if you believe in what you're doing mm -hmm. talking about the spotlight i okay. believe i'm seeing myself on the top form you know right that's the dream you know so how often do you release songs yeah sometimes it takes a while before i release songs mm -hmm. Because naked law, it's not something that needs a rush. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can be in a competition, but you have to focus on what you're building and what you're giving out to the people out there. Yeah, more of compete with yourself. Yeah, rather than compete. I'm with not. With, I'm not in a competition with anybody. Mm -hmm. Life. I'm not speeding. I'm mm -hmm. cruising. Mm -hmm. hey, I'm like taking it slow. Taking it in a slow motion. You can add the chin boom the tailor boy. This is the difference. You're not in Neka C, Kalamoy. So we're taking it slow, but slowly we're going to get there. Yeah. Oh, great. Yeah, I like that. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about your choice of music. <laughs> what kind of music do you like to listen to? Yeah, from the start, I've been look, listening to almost all types of music, mm -hmm. as I tell you, from where I was brought up. Do you listen to Zook? Zook. Yeah, it's not my it's not on my playlist. Can you dance zook? But I, I can listen to it and can I can vibe zook? to it. Give me a slow zook motion it, where it, you're sitting. It depends on the situation. So what's your situation right now? Yeah, right now I think yeah, I may be able to give you a little, you know. <laughs> no, that's not a zook. Zook is like zook is like you know someone. Anga moi kabo. Kabo, but you like anything to try. You can make anga anga nyun 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 trap ay lang anga su su dun mundi dem anga from you. Do you see trap before? Oh, wow. I'm so used to this trap. So trap. I'm so used to this style. Be do. Zook trap. Zook. Yo, I'm the only one that. Nada. Okay. So, um, who are your favorite Ghanaian artists? And <laughs> which of their songs do you listen to the most? Yeah, man. Give me okay, four. Okay, for the uh, the, the current generation or back in the days. Current generation. Back in the days, you okay. I think I will take few from current, and the few current, from back in the days. And yeah. So give me four, two current, two back in the days. Okay. I listen to E and C sometimes. General, hey, general <laughs> vibe. And yo, he, he, yeah, he's he's an artist that I like personally. Okay, which yeah. of his songs? Nyakuya. Nyakuya. Yeah. 
It all be Kenya kuya. Mero tata mbaka mana follow e Kenya kuya. Mbadi e Kenya kuya. Fue nyare kedi minya ule o e Kenya kuya. But I know ye nya kuya. Koko bende wate minne manya soto. Nga ale tentu nga munyo da kangfonsa soto. Nya kuya is what? In Mandinka. Budbu? Stress like. Anga. But okay, stress. Uh, um, uh, nyaku ya. Bukan habu mer. Di hole ni ni. Bukan 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 fast fast kanam yang ni mai. Something like that. Like definitely. Hmm. Aku mandu mak alam. Advanta bit. Yeah. Um. I listen to this guy. Um. Dali Fode Musa Suso. No, I'm going in the back. You're going back. I listen to Dali Fode Musa Suso. Fode Musa. Fode Musa Suso. Yeah, Joe Kala. He does jokers, you know. He was my dad's favorite artist. Joker, lah. Yeah, he 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 does joker, you know. What is joker? This is a it's a mandinka culture, you know. I mean, it's a totally a different music, full of proverbs. Okay. Yeah, heavy. Okay, like you play the instrument and you say something. No, this guy, this guy is one of the greatest musicians in the Gambia. He was in the U.S. He plays all kind of instrument. Wow. He is the father of Nene Jalisuso. Oh wow. Great. Yeah. He is a great person. Yeah, because yeah. is great. Yeah. I still listen to him a lot. I listen to this guy. Um, uh, Youngings or oldies? no? I'm mean, I mean the old, 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 old days. You know, let me tell you, this man. He, I think he's he's gone now. You know, Musa. Solo Suso. Solo Suso. Yeah. Solo Suso. Yeah. I've never heard about that yeah. name yeah. before. Yeah. <laughs> These are from my dad's playlist. So Solo <laughs> Solo Suso. Which yeah. of his songs? Yeah. Ali kana beke banko yuri te oti fana dandala. Oh, okay. I didn't know his name. Di 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 di. Eh, al kana lenga banko yuri te oti fana dandala. Kinding kinding kinding. I like his I like his song. Yeah, and then I listen to ST, my man, Koba Kana, yeah. Hamo, recently the collab we had, I've been fired with that a lot, um, you know. Does Hamo have video? No, it doesn't so have video. So give me one that has video. Yet. Yeah, um, the one with the video, mm -hmm. Mandinka Warrior. Who am I? I'm a Mandinka Warrior. Say, who am I? I'm a Mandinka Warrior. Are you a Mandinka warrior? Yeah, Mandinka warrior. Okay. Yeah, I, I listen to P-Mac. I am the Olaf warrior. <laughs> I listen to Have you ever heard of any Olaf warrior before? Olaf Njai, Gandhi Njai. <laughs> I believe Gandhi Njai is a warrior. Hey, Gandhi Njai is a warrior. Where are I believe Gandhi Njai is a warrior. Gandhi Njai is a warrior. You know what so I mean? do you write your songs yourself? Yeah, man. I put it in the pen. Take mm. the pen, put it in the paper. Okay. Or in the phone, yeah. So how often do you do that? And where Almost do you get in inspiration time. from? Everywhere. Do you just sit and see a Yeah, situation? I'll be walking, I'll be chilling, I'll be doing my things. I just, when it comes in, take my phone, put it in. Mm. If I have a piece of paper, I put it in. Okay. Yeah. And then you just get your beats on. Get my beats on. And then on. you have a beat and write, go to the studio. 
So how much does it cost to do all these things, recording, as, a, as an upcoming artist? Yeah, music nowadays is very expensive. Mm -hmm. And if you want good product, it costs a lot. Even back in the days, it's not easy. But now, mm -hmm. I can say, as you go into it, mm -hmm. you've got to spend more mm -hmm. to get what you want. Yeah. Yeah, and it's a whole lot of big budget, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because doing projects like an EP, bringing in videos, mm. or recording more than five, six songs, mm -hmm. having that in your project, you need to pull up a lot of cash to get to get the beats that you want originally, your own beats. Okay, not the downloaded beats. Not ones. downloaded beats. You have to get your own beats. So your previous songs, you got your own beats, not downloaded Yeah, I think ones, um, uh, from the start, mm -hmm. on the start in the beginning, I had two songs from Downloaded Beats. Okay. That was just an intro. That was the famous designer Panda beat. Okay. Sati Biko Panda. Kafu Coke and Fanta, you know what I mean? Okay. Yeah, and then I also did the back to back uh, on Kendrick Lamar's um, uh, beat with um, DJ Khalid and Big Sean, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but apart from that, I get the all other my ones beats. Where yeah, beats. yeah, pictures of So, my how beats. did you support yourself financially? getting those beats yeah you know i get support from few good people out there mm. yeah you have few good friends out there they who, contribute yeah who say, hey, support in help. a way yeah you know um, who support in a way and give him some money yeah um, so but you know that's not gonna last because you cannot get support nah, from nah, people nah, all nah, the time nah, nah, so, so how do you manage, how do you plan to raise funds yeah yourself? so doing a couple of shows mm -hmm. yeah doing a couple of events yeah, and then working hard to get myself on the booking list. Okay. So, so that the money yeah, can so come back. Yeah, so the money can start <laughs> popping, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you currently working right now? or? No, I'm not officially working. Mm -hmm. um, I'm just employed by myself. Like, um, okay. Yeah, and I do a little bit of this and a little bit of that. A little bit of rabba hanga trap game. Right. So the trap is full time for you. Full time, you. man. Great. So is chronic in a relationship? <laughs> chronic, yeah, that's the Maranga men ah, are like so big. I for my tas. Ah, like tas, no, such a tas. Yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, man. Yeah, you know what it is, man. Yo, every man gotta be loved by someone. Mm. Um, yeah, man. It's good to be loved and be loved. Yeah, yeah. It's it's great to be loved. So, the question: yeah. Are you in a relationship? It's good to be loved. Yeah. But are you in a relationship? Yeah, I have, I have, a, I have a relationship already. That's okay. why I said, one it's, yeah, one person. Oh. I said it's good to be loved by somebody. So you are a one-man person. Yeah. One, one woman, one yeah. man, woman person. Yeah. And this question is not one a surprise to me, person. though. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, to other people, it will be because you know, if, as an artist, when you have a lot of girlfriends, you don't want to yeah. sit here and say I have one girlfriend because if you have. A bunch of girls. I have the one girlfriend like, out really there. Like, oh I have one girlfriend and a whole lot of fans out there. A whole lot of good sisters. Mm -hmm. A whole lot of good people around. You know. Okay. Starts to all of them, man. Okay. <laughs> so, are your family supportive in what you're doing? Wow, wow. Well, lately, my mom is superb, man. She's, but before she wasn't. Before she, I think she, she didn't know. Like, yeah. But now she realized that this is what I'm doing. Okay terms of for her she been supportive and now the whole family is okay. everyone my cousins my nephews my niece my friends you know. oh that's great so what would you say to young people that embarks on this illegal migration journey i mean that's really sad a couple of days ago i know two people who who just sent home you know i mean how it took them almost their From life to, yeah it took them their life to get over there and they've just been sent home it's like the other one is not with his senses full time so it's crazy wow because uh, he's been sent home so he's yeah afraid. man that's the issue right now i mean making me talk about that it's not cool over here because i might just start and i won't go off no but that's what i want i want you as an artist because you are the voice of the voice yeah you know the thing you know, is you like have to um um express your feelings and also send a message out there to the people that are embarking on this journey to let them know that it's not a good you know thing to do it's not a good move at all the mm -hmm. brothers know that but like most people they don't have hope here they have no future here that's how they see it 
So, but do you think there's a future? Do you think there is future in the Gambia? There is future in the Gambia, but so many things need to be right for us to benefit from these things. Things like? Things that we are liking. Employment, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Good salaries. Mm -hmm. People are working, but at the end of the like day, companies. Yeah, companies, people are working at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. You work for night, a whole month. Mm -hmm. You cannot even have, it's crazy. You, it's, it's crazy, you know. You see people, they be working from seven to nine, you know, come home late. Every day they be standing on the roadside. Mm -hmm. Out of that, they are little salary. They're supposed to pay school for their kids, mm -hmm. take care of House other needs. Rent, it's food, crazy. Maybe less than, less than $3,000. Can you imagine? Sometimes you would own $3,000. You will hold $3,000 in your hand. Mm -hmm. You are about to do something. You go out there less than some minutes. Mm -hmm. All the money is gone. How can somebody survive from that for a month? It's crazy. It's really crazy. It's just and the crazy, interdependency man. rate is very high in Gambia. People because your family member would come and say, Chronic, I'm so broke. Please yeah. help me. You know, with that 3000 that you are thinking of paying your kids' school fees and all the other things, and they start telling you their own problems. So it's a very crazy situation at the end of the day. I think the government needs to set up something. They need to set up a lot. Not only the government. And the youths, they need a whole lot of sensitization. Mm -hmm. People think so differently here also. But they need to bring it to people's understanding. Mm -hmm. They need to create ways for us, the youths here. Because, for example, I, Chronic Bob, I have a talent. I'm trying to do music. But I go through a whole lot. So, for example, what of someone who does not even have a talent? Who don't even have a basic education? How do you expect that person to survive if me with a talent trying to grind, I'm struggling? It's crazy. It's crazy. You know, I feel um, in Gambia, um, there's this thing that people consider the most, which is self-development rather than national development. development. You know, everybody wants to develop yourself. You would see somebody that, that um, has been um, promoted in a post or just given a post in the government and, and then all you think is myself, myself, myself. I think it's high time we... Start we focus think, on the national development Yeah, national plan. development, help young people out there. So, you know, I mean, it's going to be easy for everyone. And you artists as well, you know, can thrive in what you're doing. Because music is something that, is, that, that really make, makes money in a country. Art is beautiful. But when you talk about Gambian art, especially national arts and culture, what are they really doing about um, the, the entertainment scene in the Gambia? I think, I think, I think it's recently... I mean, they started uh, focusing on the Gambian arts and entertainment a bit mm -hmm. yeah, lately because artists started breaking records in the Gambia here. And I think it's high time for them to realize that mm -hmm. they invest in the artists here, in the young people here. Let them boost the entertainment up mm -hmm. yeah, because they're sleeping on us. Like open schools. Open schools. Know? Create something that every artist will be under it. Create something that our music will be played. And we will gain realities from it. Create platforms for the artist. Give them a job. Give them an employment. Mm. You know, you bring in artists outside. That's not a problem. Mm -hmm. But make sure Gambian artists get stages. It's getting better though this year. We've, we've seen quite a lot of changes. So hopefully, if everybody put up what you have to put up, we add it up. Mm -hmm. Things will slowly get to where we want it to be. Inshallah. Yeah, as we say, unity is strength. We all should come one Gambia first mm -hmm. in whatever we do. Yeah, we'll get to where we want to be. What projects do you um, have going on in 2019? Yeah, 2019, watch out for my big bad concert, you know, my big bad project, Lubu mm Tikesu. -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. and then um, uh, as you know, I'm having a couple of shows mm -hmm. starting from this weekend, Friday. Saturday, uh, Saturday on the 2nd also, I'll be on the show. On the 15th, that's my big, my big promoter's event. My mm -hmm. promoter, my own personal promoter, Big Boy Boyang. Mm -hmm. That's on the 15th March, I'll be there in Brikama, Joko. Mm -hmm. Same way, um, uh, the Shutero Konao with my niggas. Are you going Mafia on Black. tours, on musical tours? I'm not on tours right now, but it's scheduled. I've just been around some parts here in the combos. Mm -hmm. I've had a couple of shows in... Gunjul. Mm -hmm. um, uh, uh, this last Independence Night, I was at Lamin. I had a show there at Willis. Yeah, but my tour, I'm scheduling it up. 
I'm, I'm busy in the studio mm -hmm. working on the Lubri Keso project. Okay. Yeah, that's a concert that. Mm -hmm. So, any artists that you are collaborating with? This so, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I will have I will have artists in. I already have uh, a collab with T Smalls. Mm -hmm. That's in the. It's Five already lines. there. It's already there. Okay. You know? Oh, it's already there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm done with a couple of tracks. They already there, man. Just so how many tracks do you um, work on in an EP? You know, um, my my, my first EP six? was four. Four. Yeah. Okay. My four tracks. Why four? So, yeah, that was just an introduction. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And yeah. then this one, how much are you working this on? This one, I've not decided yet how many songs are to be on it. But it's a project. You should yeah. know how many songs you want to yeah, have. Yeah, because I'm, I, I, I'm exactly. gonna I'm gonna take the best ones. It could be more than what I normally put down. Okay. So I'm just putting them down. So, can you play any instrument, musical instruments? And for the moment, I can only do the djembe. Okay. Yeah, I can make nice sounds from the djembe. Mm -hmm. But I'm also learning how to do the production on my own. Okay. Yeah, and learning on vocals and other stuff. Great. At the studio back there. Do you have any dream record label that you want to work with? Yeah, man. In the future? Yeah, man. <laughs> Big dreams, you know, different record labels, you know, yeah, international. Okay. Yeah, and have a dream of establishing my own record label here okay. soon. Inshallah. Inshallah. And yeah, artist as well. Yeah, man. Okay, so one question before we leave. Yeah. If you were to be an animal in this world, <laughs> <laughs> I know the question yeah. is a little bit weird, <laughs> but if you were to be an animal in this world, yeah. which animal will you be and why? Which animal of, of would I be and why? Mm. Hey, hmm. <laughs> this question. If it takes people seconds, it will not take me a second then. Why? Yeah, because, because you I really have to think of which animal. If, yeah, you know, I like. How about uh, <laughs> goat? No, the goat. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the goat is good in the dog palette. <laughs> Chicken. I prefer a rabbit. You know. Why rabbit? Yeah, a rabbit is nice. It's cute. It's um. But you're gonna get eaten, you know. Yeah, you you're gonna get eaten, you know. But I asked, everything. I asked someone this question, and the person. Get eaten, you know. And and no no no, not everything will get eaten. Yeah. A lion will never get eaten. Yeah, a lion will not because get lion eaten. Because lion is the king. Yeah, lion is the king. In As the an artist, I was thinking you would choose an animal that is going to represent the king, because every artist would say I'm the queen, I'm the imam, I'm the whatever, you know, the ego trip thingy. Yeah, well. You said you came out a rabbit. Yeah. Rabbit is very easy. I'm sure someone in um um if I bring another artist they would choose to be a python and they would eat you. <laughs> <laughs> well, and the fact that uh, okay they can eat me like that mouth to mouth, but, but not in a real life, you. you know, it's impossible. <laughs> Literally, and, they yeah, can eat. Yeah, you. and the reason I choose the rabbit because I like I love the rabbit. Okay. Yeah. Well, it's fair enough. Yeah. It's your decision, yeah. and I have yeah. to respect it. I love it. the rabbit, you know. It's 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 cute. It's false, you know. Mm. It's not. It's and not it's very, very smart. Yeah, you can have him in your house. You but know, but it gets blind at night. <laughs> and the meat is the best one. Anyways, <laughs> have you ever tried it before? Yeah, I did. I ate that a couple of times. You know. Oh great. Yeah, yeah. So, can you give us a freestyle before we wrap up the show? Yeah, man. Bribery for the money, but poor hotel. Let's privilege my rights at a court hotel. Mbali Danila, Ali Makoi Boro Lana Laptano to Ali Sol Dundi Dokwoto Bunda Jama Jama Selo Kolea Eko Julio Minil Tate Bese Joe. This was not the reason for that independence. I guess you all know we still dependent to keep my mouth closed. Don't mean malum member kidding. Guess to keep it silence while I tin and tell but dating. A <laughs> Hey, that's dope. That's dope. I like that. Anyways, um, it was good having you here. It's a pleasure too, playlist. man. It's a pleasure, man. Um, you really killed it. It's a pleasure, and man. And I'm just going to encourage you to strive harder in what you're doing. You Bless just got to believe in yourself and Bless everything up. will fall into place. Bless, up. Bless up. Um, To you out there that watch the playlist show, thank you guys. And I'm going to say continue watching because we will be coming with different um, artists and um, a whole lot of different conversation that is going to make you know a lot about the entertainment scene if you're really interested. So stay with us and bye. Thank you.